Number 10. The Earth has three main layers, the crust, containing the oceanic crust and the continental crust, and part of the lithosphere. The mantle contains the other part of the lithosphere and the asthenosphere, which has convection currents. The last layer is the core, which is divided into the inner and outer core. It is made of iron nickel. Number 9. The continental drift is a theory first hypothesized by Alfred Wegener. It states that the continents had moved from their original locations. The original continent called Pangaea separated into Laurasia and Gondwana land, which separated into the seven continents we know today. Number eight. Energy resources have two categories, non-renewable and renewable resources. Non-renewable resources are consumed faster than they're made. An example would be fossil fuels, which includes coal, oil, and natural gas. Renewable resources can be replenished as fast as they are consumed. Examples are solar, wind, and hydroelectric energy, as well as biomass and geothermal energy. Number 7. Weather is the state of the atmosphere at a certain place in time and is a short-term variation of the atmosphere. Because of this, weather is always changing. Weather can be determined by precipitation, humidity, cloudiness, pressure, and winds. Number 6. Clouds are a mass of water droplets or ice crystals suspended in the atmosphere. Clouds form through condensation, which is when millions of water vapor droplets come together. There are three main types of clouds. Stratus clouds that blanket the sky, cumulus clouds, which are puffy and fluffy, and cirrus clouds, which are thin and wispy. This so is my number five pick. Storms are disturbance in the atmosphere made of wind, rain, snow, hail, sleet, or thunder and lightning. Number four. There are four seasons, summer, spring, winter, and fall. Each season is marked by weather patterns and hours of daylight. The days with uneven hours of day and night are solstices. The days with even hours of day and night are called equinoxes. Number three. Comets are a chunk of ice and rock found in the Kupier belt near Neptune. Asteroids are rocks in orbit generally between Mars and Jupiter. Meteoroids are space rocks that are smaller than an asteroid. Meteors are meteoroids that enter the atmosphere. However, most burn up in the mesosphere. Meteorites are meteors that don't burn up in the atmosphere and crash on the Earth's surface. Number 2 the water cycle is a cycle of processes in which water circulates between the Earth's oceans, atmosphere, and land. There are four main processes in the water cycle. Evaporation is the process of water droplets turning into vapor. Transpiration is like evaporation, except it comes from plants. Condensation is the process of water vapor turning into water droplets. This process creates clouds. Next is precipitation. Precipitation is any form of water that falls to the ground from clouds. Examples would be rain, snow, sleet, or hail. Number one! Woo! First off are the terrestrial planets, aka the inner planets. Terrestrial means of or relating to Earth. The terrestrial planets are Mercury, Venus, Earth, and Mars. Some characteristics of the terrestrial planets are that they are small, they have solid surfaces, they're rocky, and that they have thin carbon dioxide or nitrogen atmospheres. These are the Jovian, aka outer planets. Jovian means of or relating to Jupiter. The Jovian planets are Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. The Jovian planets are large, about 10 times the size of Earth. There are two types of Jovian planets, the gas giants, Saturn and Jupiter, and the ice giants, Neptune and Uranus. The gas giants, Saturn and Jupiter, are made mostly of hydrogen and helium. Neither of them have a solid surface. 
The ice giants, Neptune and Uranus, are made of ice, with hydrogen, helium, and methane in the atmosphere. Methane is what gives the planets their blue color. Like the gas giants, the ice giants do not have a solid surface.